Kule is dressing her children for the biggest celebration of the year. Nowruz is a Persian tradition that's also celebrated by some 40 million Kurds across the region. It marks the first day of the new year, but it brings back painful memories for this mother who had to flee her home in Syria. It's been five years. It's so difficult. The family left Kobane five years ago. They're now living in Diyarbakir, the capital of Turkey's Kurdish region. Once they're dressed and ready to go, they leave for the festival. Tens of thousands of people are gathered here. There's music, dancing, and a bonfire to symbolize a fresh start. For many, celebrating Nowruz means marking their Kurdish identity. This 65-year-old grandfather was born in Turkey, but always refused to speak in a language other than the one he considers his native tongue, Kurdish. The celebration means we're still here. We won't give up. It's a matter of honor. At the podium, a succession of fiery speeches. This year, Nowruz fell just days before municipal elections. Turkey's HDP, the pro-Kurdish People's Democracy Party, is combining culture and politics with a rally. I believe that as Nowruz ushers in spring, this election will bring hope and a fresh era for the people. Four years ago, the HDP had won municipalities in Diyarbakir and in the region, but the majority were replaced by technocrats from Ankara, and it could happen again this year. The replacement of 96 mayors was like an attempted coup against Kurdish politics. We're now running elections again, and by again threatening to replace us, it is a threat against democracy and the will of the people. In the crowd, HDP supporters call their political enemy by his name. Who is Erdogan? I'm not afraid of him. We are celebrating our Nowruz. Our friends are in jail and they are on hunger strike. For them, we will stand with HDP. We elected the lawmakers and local officials. What right do they have to replace them? And they don't have the right to remove the people we choose. If they do it again, we will protest in the streets. If necessary, we'll go to the mountain. Going to the mountain, a code for joining the Kurdistan Workers' Party, the PKK. The Kurdish guerrilla group launched an armed struggle against the Turkish government in 1984. It's classified as a terrorist group in Ankara, but also in the United States and the European Union. And it's precisely because the ruling AK Party considers the HDP to be linked to the PKK that it justifies replacing its elected officials in the name of national security and the fight against terrorism. This AK Party candidate explained the government's position. What the president said is this. If the HDP do as we say, why would they need to be replaced? But until today, all of their members have surrendered their decision-making power to Kandil. Kandil, the name of the mountains in Iraqi Kurdistan, where the PKK has its headquarters. As the celebrations wind down, the family from Kobane makes a wish, a Nowruz tradition. Our wish is to have a country. We suffered injustice from Turkey, Iran, Syria, all of them. Yes, soon. I think so. God willing. That wish is less and less likely to see the day, even as it's passed on to the young generation.